Hey YouTubers, Electric Adventures here with the big event of the year. Yes, it's time for YouTuber of the year. So, been doing YouTuber of the month all year. Um, and um, now it's the end of the year. I've got the results for you um, uh, for the last YouTuber of the month, which is December. And what we're going to do is I've got together all of the channels that won YouTuber of the month and they've all done a little video uh, segment, basically either telling um, you all why you should vote for them for YouTuber of the Weir or year or why you should vote for somebody else um, Potentially in a Christmas theme some of them have done that some of them haven't it doesn't really matter Right, so I'm going to play the videos in reverse order. So we're going to start with uh, the YouTuber of the Month, December 2013, and that's the Weekend Game Guy. Well, guys, if you're seeing me, you know why I'm here. Apparently, I won YouTuber of the Month for December or November. I'm the last one of the year, and uh, I guess I'm kind of at an advantage because I'm the first person you get to see, so I'll probably be the most memorable one for you, right? Maybe? No? Maybe not? We'll see. Man, I look really... Bags under my eyes. I look rough. Anyway, I want to thank Electric Adventures for taking over the YouTuber of the Month series. And uh, it's been really fun to check in every month and see a lot of great new channels um, for me. So that's really been, you know, a lot of fun. Um, I also really want to thank Soft Otaku. I'm a big fan of your channel. And uh, I was honored you nominated me, frankly. And uh, apparently you like the way I talk. And that's, that's cool. Like the beard looks good. Anyway, um, so yeah, so the thanks are out of the way, and now I've got to try to sell myself for YouTuber of the Year. I have no clue how I'm gonna do that. Um, yeah, I, I I just don't know what's gonna happen here. Uh, you know, I, I I do the best I can to try to uh, you know, present good content to you guys. You know, between uh. Um, what I do on my channel, I also do the podcast, um, or I've been doing a podcast, and, and I'm now relaunching that podcast with uh, Mr. Dude 206 and Michael B. the Game Genie and Keep the Joking Gamer. We're doing the Playing with Power um, podcast now, and we're going to record the first episode next week. Um, you know, I, I really try my best to, to, to be part of the community and to inject um, community in things I do. Um, I've always, I've survived off that, really. I think the only reason I've got as many subs as I have has always been because of, of the community aspect of YouTube and really just making friends, not just producing content and good or bad or whatever. It's always been, you know, um, community-driven. So, you know, I don't know. If you like me, vote for me for YouTuber of the Year. If you don't like me, that's fine. Please check me out and check the podcast out. I, I just I just hope that you come by and maybe I, I do something you'll enjoy. What's up, people? I just want to make a quick video to say thank you to everyone who uh, has been participating in the YouTuber of the Month thingy. And uh, thanks for, for allowing me to be a part of it. And uh, it's been fun. Uh, happy holidays. I'm getting ready to uh, spend some time in the U.S. here pretty soon and uh, might be meeting a few people. <laughs> Spoilers that uh, you know. Um, I, Tony asked me to tell you why you should vote for me for YouTuber of the Year. <laughs> I can't do that because I don't think you should. Uh, I'm super honored to have been uh, selected for, I guess it was October. And uh, man, that's enough. That was super, super awesome. And uh, I can't really talk right now, <laughs> so I should make this uh, end soon. Mmm, what else can I say? I said Happy Holidays, yeah, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, um, whatever, you know, all that stuff. Um, thank you, I said that. Uh, congratulations to everyone else who uh, was a YouTuber of a month. And uh, I would say may the best person win, but, you know, it... What can I say? It's just, uh... I won't tell you who to vote for, but, uh... I, I won't be upset if you don't vote for me. <laughs> uh, but I am looking forward to seeing um, more of these videos and seeing you know whoever does when what he or they do right does uh, with with the uh, with the contest in the future. So uh, want to watch some kids play baseball. Ah. 
Ah, boring. Okay. Anyway, there you go. Not a bad sunset. Thanks again, everyone, and uh, happy holidays. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. <laughs>
will be cool. And uh, I wish all of you a very happy Christmas. Uh, look at my USB magically glowing snowman. And it's actually changing color, slowly changing color. And uh, yeah, you can see. Uh, this is actually plugged in year round, so I love it. So uh, yeah, I like uh, the changing colors. Uh, but yeah, uh, why should I be YouTuber of the year? Well, to make up for the month that I was YouTuber of the month? <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, there has been a great number of uh, YouTubers uh, this, uh, this season, this year. And I think every one of them is very deserving and I would not be disappointed if I wasn't a YouTuber of the year. But I would be just be totally blown away if I was, but uh, I guess there's, uh, that's not in the stars for me, but that's alright. And uh, I'm very curious who will actually end up being YouTuber of the year 2013. Well, Mark signing off and I'll be back. And uh, perhaps uh, Tony will use a very little of this or all of it. Not sure, but, uh, but yeah, <laughs> Mark signing off. Oops. And now turn off this thingy. Hi, this is Dave Webster, and I just want to start this segment off by saying a big thank you to Electric Adventures, who has been running this contest for the last 18 months, two years or so. And this is a really, really great thing because it means that people in the community that perhaps previously weren't aware of each other can get to know each other and smaller channels get exposure and that kind of thing and it really helps the community because I've been doing this for about 18 months or so and there's been a lot of changes in that time and I think the community is such a great thing but having events like this really just helps keep you know everything moving along and it's it's great and if this keeps running for another 18 months, two years more, this is, this is great. So. I've been asked to give a, a quick description of my channel and ex, you know, kind of explain myself for why someone should vote for me and that kind of thing. And so my channel is mainly about gameplay videos, so I take the camera, point at the screen, play a game, talk rubbish for about 15 minutes and recollect about my experiences playing it the first time when first played some of these games and sometimes these are games I picked up recently and my experiences of playing them in 2013 for the first time. So the other thing that I do is the weekend waffle and that's very similar to this. I point the camera and, and talk for about 15-20 minutes or sometimes more as has happened and these are sometimes at the weekend, not always and not always every week but it's normally when I've got a topic to talk about so they're not, they're not regular but you know they're here and there. So the last thing is this, so this is the Sega Dreamcast. So about 10 years ago I used to do some homebrew development, I never made anything professional, I never sold anything, but I used to just play around and just you know, treat it as a learning experience. But I've not done it for about 10 years and I just decided about a year ago to get back into doing it. So when I've been developing bits and pieces I've just put them up onto YouTube and just show what I've been up to and, and you know, people watch them and give me some really supportive feedback. So I'll end this video by saying when I was fortunately voted YouTuber of the month a few months ago I nominated five people and those five people were Lactobacillus Prime, Kimball Justice, Games Bloke, Riddler on YouTube and Retro Bulls and I just want to say that all five of those guys are equally deserving and I think if you're looking for a new channel to subscribe to or just looking for something a little bit different or someone that you've not come across before I would certainly recommend you know looking for those channels you'd be able to find them on my channel if you look at my subscriptions or my subscribers then you'll be able to see that all five of those guys on there so I'll finish it there so I just want to say thanks to everyone that voted me YouTuber of the month a few months ago and thanks to Electric Adventures for running this contest and everyone in the community it's great so thanks for watching post. 1975. Hello, I'm here to tell you to vote for me in YouTuber of the Year. Now you're probably saying to yourself, but why Lone Boy? Why should we vote for you? And that's a very good question. I often wonder that myself when I'm alone in my mind palace. The answer really is quite simple. You should vote for me because my intelligent, articulate and mind-blowing grasp of the English language. Here, let me show you.
Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck off. Oh, piss off. Oh, bollocks. Oh, bollocks. Ooh, fuck. Oh, shit nuggets. Sexy motherfucker. Oh, triple rainbows. I'm a fucking death machine. Oh, I just died. So vote for me. Lawn Boys Post, 1975. And read my lips. No more taxes. I play in the Call of Duty Gorts. Call of Duty Gorts? Yeah. So Call of Duty Gorts? Yeah. I will play in Legend of Zebra. Sixteen bit bros. Well, the 16 bit bros, but we've got different bums. We've got different bums. This here is Danny D. He is a mong. A fucking mong. Oh, yeah. You take that back, you hair in the sack. <laughs> no, I ain't. No, I ain't having that. Let's pay everyone with the 16 bit brothers. Brought nostalgia nights, masturbated among others. All that we want is to win the tour of the year. So hold for us. We don't shed any tears. So we don't shed any tears. We'd like to thank everybody. The Void of the YouTube. It's been a lot to us. Thank you. So we don't shed any tears. Thank you. YouTube video. <laughs> Hi. Well, so why do I think you should vote for Rian? For Re? Why do I think you guys should vote for Ricky and I? I don't really. For one, Ricky's not here. We've been filming every night this week, and every time something would happen that would stop us from doing this, so we forgot. We suck. Thank you guys for even having us do YouTuber of the Month. That was awesome. This is cool to be a part of this again. There's some really awesome people in here, and. I know with that said, I kind of have a reason for who I want you to vote for. I don't want you to vote for us. Honestly, I don't. The person I want you to vote for is whoever all the people are that get named. Pick the one that has the smallest amount of subscribers and vote for them because it's the holiday season and it's about spreading love. So I say we give more publicity to who has the smallest amount of subscribers because they could use it. Uh, Ricky and I don't need it. I mean, we have an awesome group of people that follow us, you know, a lot of subscribers and we're super thankful for that. And we. Uh, we appreciate it, so we think we should spread the love. I called Ricky and he said, yeah, let's just tell him to vote for whoever has the lowest amount of subscribers because they deserve it. Deserve it. Deserve it. Yeah, so that's all I know. Normally we do crazy wild stuff, but I just woke up. <laughs> yeah, so I just wanted to say, give us some love to uh, the lowest amount of subscribers of all the people here. Yeah, thank you guys. Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, happy Kwanzaa, and if you don't celebrate it, whatever. Everybody have a good one. See ya. Hey folks, how's it going? 64-Bit Matthew here with another video. Except this one's not on my channel, it's on Electric Adventures channel. And the reason for that is because he's doing this video where he shows all the winners of YouTuber of the Month for this year. And yeah, I was lucky enough to win April's YouTuber of the Month, so I just want to say 
thanks to you guys for that. Um, I really do appreciate it. I thought it was really cool. It was a big honor. And yeah, so thanks to everyone that voted. And so basically for this video, um, I wanted to accomplish three things. Now, I know the point of this video is supposed to be that I'm supposed to kind of talk to you about why I deserve to be YouTuber of the year. But I've never really been good at talking about myself or hyping myself up. So I'm not really going to do that. Basically, for this video, there's three things. Uh, the first, I wanted to use this as an excuse to wear my lovely Christmas sweater. Not sure how much of the sweater is in the video, but yes, it's very sparkly, snowman-y, and present -y, So it's got the nice little collar. So I want to use it for uh, a reason to use my wear my sweater. So that um, I want to take a quick chance to say thanks to Tony, aka Electric Adventures, aka one of the coolest people here on YouTube uh, for always setting up this YouTuber of the month. It's a lot of work. There's a lot of voting, uh, counting the votes, setting videos up, putting videos together, and he does it every month. So thank you, Tony, for doing that. It's a really cool part of the gaming community, and you do a lot of work. So thanks for that, bud. Um, and I guess the last thing I want to say, I already said thanks for voting me for April. So thanks again for that. And Regardless of who you vote for, thanks for taking the time to watch this video. Thanks for taking the time to vote, whether it's me or whether it's one of the other YouTubers. Everyone that's in this video deserves to be voted for, so if I don't win, I'm really not going to be that mad or anything, because it's some really cool competition or some really cool other YouTubers in the video. So, yeah. Anyway, I kind of rambled, so I'll end the video. Uh, thanks again to everyone that's voted, everyone that's part of the gaming community. Thanks to Tony, aka Electric Adventures, for setting this whole thing up. And yeah, Merry Christmas, and thanks again for letting me be a part of the YouTuber of the Month for April. So, later. Hey, what's up everyone? This is OK Chief. And um, back in February, I believe, uh, I won the YouTuber of the Month, which I was completely just enthralled. I was in complete awesome. And as everyone knows, there is a running for a YouTuber of the year at the end of the year. So all of us are asked to make this short video um, and uh, just you know, pretty much going through, if you haven't kept up with who was winning throughout the uh, throughout the year, uh, here are all the nominees that won uh, YouTuber of the Month, and now we've all collaged or collabed together, and um, you're seeing everyone who's won throughout the year, and you get to vote on your favorite YouTuber, and if um, I should happen to be your favorite YouTuber, then give me a vote. And if not, I'm pretty sure you will not have a hard time finding a good YouTuber on here. Um, we're all YouTubers because people like us, or uh, YouTubers of the month because people like us. And uh, if you if you happen to find someone in there that you like, then vote for them. I mean, that's what this is all about, and uh, we're all trying to select a YouTuber of the year. So with that being said, I just want to take this time not to ask you to vote for me, but I just want to take this time to just say thank you all for watching throughout the year. It's just been one amazing ride. It's it's been it's been incredible and I've just had a blast entertaining you guys and I've just had a blast documenting and just sharing everything I've done throughout the year. Um I've, just, I've always done it. I've just never documented it, you know? And that's basically what I'm doing. There's no fancy editing. There's no fancy nothing. It's just me and my best friend, Will, uh, going out and having a good time and sharing our experiences with you guys. That's basically this. my whole show is all about. It's just sharing my experiences with you. And, uh, and I'm glad to do it. Everyone has fun. I have fun with it. Um, if you don't have fun with my videos, I'm sorry to hear that, but um, I just put out what I what I experience. I'm I, I'm not necessarily um, 
uh, following any kind of script or anything on what I do on my videos. I just pretty much go with the flow. I, I just record real life and I show it to you guys. And uh, for the people who tune in day in and day out for everything that I put out, man, you guys know who you are. Thank you guys. That's This is what I'm taking the time for um, and just and just say thank you guys. That's That's all I really... It comes down to, and for everyone that's been nominated throughout the year and has won the YouTuber of the month, congratulations, and I wish you guys luck for the YouTuber of the year, and uh, I hope to see more great YouTubers come out this next year, and hopefully uh, we'll, we'll catch another gem on, on one of those YouTubers again. So for those of you, again, who watch me every day, thank you guys so much, and for the YouTubers out there trying to win the YouTuber of the year, can. I wish you all the best of luck, and um, I just continue to do what I do. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out, y'all. Hey, I'm Mr. Dude. Man, Matt. No, I'm Dude Mister. No. I'm 206. No. I'm the Sega Sonar 206, Dude Mister. And uh, apparently a while ago I won YouTuber of the Month. From a dude, Mr. Mr. Dude, 206? Yeah. Anyways, um, so, yeah, hi. I guess it's the end of the year because I'm making a video to say, hey, you should pick me as the YouTuber of the year. Why? I don't know. Because I'm the Sega Stoner, 206 Mr. Dude Man. And, you know, I watch VCDs. Guess where I got these? from the guy who nominated me to be YouTuber of, of, of the month before, a while back. Mr. Dude 206. Yeah. Um, he thought I was cool enough to be YouTuber of the month, so maybe you think I'm cool enough to be YouTuber of the year. Probably not, but hey, hey, I'm the sex donor. Mr. Dude 206 thought I was cool enough. And yeah, so keep up the tradition and vote. And I don't know what to say, because, yeah, Mr. Dude 206, Six Donor, whoever's next. Yeah. What's going on, YouTube? How are you doing? And this is apparently the video that goes ahead and asks why I should be YouTuber of the Year. Previously, as a winner of YouTuber of the Month of January 2013, I'd say that was a very awesome thing that had happened in my YouTube career. And just pretty cool to know and be recognized and all that jazz, you know what I'm saying? But as for YouTuber of the Year, that's a big deal. And it's it's even a bigger deal with the, the, the freaking runners-up and the, the, the people running for the YouTuber of the Year for the 2013. We have, you know, the, the Chief, we have the Stoner, we have Retro Liberty, we have the Lawn Boy, we have Otaku, we have the Grub Gun, we have a lot of people. The Dave Webster, Lactus Basilius Prime, we have, uh, who else am I forgetting here? The 16-Bit Bros, 64-Bit Matthew. A lot of mofos that are cool on here, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, that's a shout out to all you guys, and it was really awesome to get to know you guys. So, I believe everybody deserves to be a YouTuber of the year. But if you just happen to choose me, Mr. Dude 206 I promise you that I will continue to bring random ass videos about gaming my dog, the Frame Meister, cars, and anything that I choose to put up on here strictly for your entertainment. And, you know, nothing's going to change either way. So, you know, I'm just trying to keep it real here, trying to keep it short as well. But I also want to thank Tony, Electric Adventures, for keeping on the YouTuber of the Month and YouTuber of the Year tradition going on. And it's really awesome that something like this can, com they can keep the community together and have everyone actually participate. And you never know how small this community is until you're actually a part of it and to get to know everyone in it. So, um, I don't really know what I was supposed to say here, but if you want to vote for me, Mr. Dude 206 to be YouTuber over there, that would be flippin' awesome! But either way, it's still cool that, um, everybody in this running is, you know, homies to the end. So anyways, this is Mr. Dude 206, on to this next person that's gonna go ahead and promote themselves. So I'll just go ahead and end it and cut it here. 
Thanks a lot, Mr. Dude 206, and um, take care. Later. Right, so lots of thanks go out to all of the YouTubers um, who sent in their videos. Um, obviously, it takes you know quite a while to um, get together all of those videos and um, chase everybody down. Um, very everybody has various schedules of when they produce videos and things like that, but they all did a very good job. So now it's all up to you guys out there. You need to vote for the YouTuber of the year by basically placing the name of one of the YouTubers of the month down below in the comment section. I'll put a links to all of their channels down below to make it easier for you as well and get the names right. Um, I will run this until the end of January, uh, the voting, and um, then I'll close it off and put together a um, YouTuber of the Month January 2014 video with Weekend Game Guys nominations um, and announce the YouTuber of the Year then. Uh, we may have a crowning ceremony or something like that. We'll see what we can work out at the time. And then it's um, onwards to a, uh, a um, t wonderful 2014. Hope everybody has a wonderful holiday season and, um, and new year. And um, thank you all for watching. Thanks to my subscribers. And I'll catch you later.